All right, title, what's up? We got uh, August 3rd, board briefing, all right? So this is Wednesday. Warm up, nine movements, 50 feet at a time. So we'll be moving across the gym. It's gonna be a uh, running warm up, specific warm up. It's not anything special today. We're not snatching, we're not uh, cleaning or jerking. Uh, straight up, just one round, 200 meters. We should be under 100, or 100 115 seconds. Um, 115 or lower, okay? If we're not under that 115 mark for a 200 meter run, we should really think about scaling um, your runs down in the workout, okay? So our workout today is called Run It Back. All right, RX, every five minutes for three rounds, you're gonna run 800 meters. If you happen to run that 800 meters in four minutes, that means you would get one minute rest, and then you would go again, okay? Uh, and you repeat that three times. And then after your final rest period, we're gonna go, three, two, one, go. Every three minutes, you're gonna run 400 meters, okay? And that's gonna be five rounds. And our goals, or sorry, let's talk about level one. F uh, every five minutes for three rounds, you're gonna run 400 meters. And then every three minutes for five rounds, you're gonna run 200 meters, okay? Our goal here today, um, 800 meters, we wanna be around 330 to 430, okay? We want at least 30 seconds rest between before we start our next interval. For, uh, the 400 meter runs, we wanna be between 130 and 230. Again, we have three minutes to do that, we want at least 30 seconds rest, all right? Now, um, for you heavy hitters out here, hear me out. You runners, we want this workout done at an aerobic pace, which means they're not flat out sprints, all right? We're trying to build some aerobic capacity here. And in order to do aerobic capacity, we don't want a heart rate where it's so jacked up, it's just <laughs> fluttering. Okay, we want to control that heart rate, and I would say between 70 and I would even go as far as saying 80% effort, and that might be a little bit high, but we'll take it there. Okay, so we want repeatable efforts, and what that means if you're a fast runner and you know you can do an 800 in three minutes, but that's about your top end, like oh, I really had to push, push hard for that three minute. Why don't you take it back a little bit and run a 3.30 and then try to repeat every 800 at that same pace. That's what we're looking for, right? And same with the 400. If you have a 400 meter and you have a one minute 400, dial it back a little bit and try to hit 130 or 120 or 135 or 140, depending where you are in your running skill and, and your capacity, and try to run those repeatedly five times in a row. Okay, that's how we're going to build some aerobic capacity, um, especially for running. Running's a great tool for um, building that, but a lot of people come out of the gate way high and then they sort of drop off at the end. We want to maintain all these paces right as far as we can, right? Um, that's our board briefing for the day. If you need to row, there will be some substitutions for rowing and biking. I'd rather see biking then rowing. Biking sort of simulates a little bit more um, quad dominance than the rower does. All right, guys? So bikes come first, then rowers. All right, enjoy the workout. Get your running gear out. Uh, it's going to be a hot one tomorrow, so be ready for it. Bring lots of water.